Welcome back, folks. In the last episode, we were still trying to figure out how to distract Mr. Hobbins. Um, we are playing as Robert Foster, and our job objective in this game, the first objective will be to get out of this city, which we were brought with force. This will be actually quite difficult, so we'll spend actually the most part of this game in this city. The second objective will be to find out who brought us here and why we were um, yeah what our parents are the first thing of the first thing we do is to distract Mr. Hobbins and as I remember it you have to it has to something to do with pulling this lever and using this metal bar. I'm not sure what is the correct solution. Okay, that's wrong, apparently. Yes. I know that. Um, actually, before I do anything else, I wanted to um, enable captions. Excuse me. Yeah. I think that. Yeah. What now? Might be useful for you, viewer. I'll get on with my inspection. You do that, son. Okay, let's look at the laser. Sleek, high precision, and high powered. And at the lock. It's more impressive than the ones back home. Can you just pull the lever, please? Oh, you can, actually. Smart design. What are you doing? Get out! Let's be put. Okay. So maybe it's about time. So let, let's wait until this. He is really distracted. Like now. What are you doing? Get out! Um. That's my personal property! Hmm. What are you doing? Get out! That's my personal property! What are you doing? Get out! That's my personal property! Something I'm missing here. What are you doing? Get out! That's my personal something. property! I think it has to do... This puzzle has to do with this robot in the other room. Uh, Forget it. I think we have to get Joey to step out of this platform and to set off the alarm. Forget it. Hmm. Maybe it has nothing to do with distracting Mr. Hobbins at all. I'm not putting my hand anywhere near there. There's a video camera which is blinking. It's much too high to reach. Quite that thing's unusual. watching me. Good thing I'm naturally photogenic. 
video camera, I'd say. Yeah, the PS Joey shell is not so useless after all. You didn't tell me you could fly. I didn't know I had it in me. This must be where the scrap gets melted. Is that why you brought me here? Don't worry, kid. They'd only take premium quality scrap. <laughs> Think this could be a way out? Through the furnace? I don't rate our chances. If you can't be sensible, be quiet. I think we're being watched. They I seem to think, think you're someone special. I can't imagine why. Well, I... Formel... Um, can actually, but... Forget it. Let's look at this lock. I've got nothing that would fit. It must need a special card. Hmm. I just hope we have this special card. Actually, we don't, but... Maybe Joey... Can open this door. Can you open that door? I'll give it a try. No sudden moves over, man. Get over to the furnace. You're Officer Reich, I presume. You've made a mistake. I'm not Overman. Link, we can't let him escape. What the hell is going on? Reich seems pretty cut up about it. But he's given me two leads. Overman and Link. Yeah, that's the end of Reich. Yeah, for point and click adventure. Beneath a star steel sky is pretty brutal sometimes. And we've got got two new links. Um leads, I mean. Overman and the Reich. Uh, sorry. Overman and Link. Of course. Let's look at the corpse of Mr. Reich. Barbecued. I'll never eat kebab again. He was carrying an ID card. The card may be useful. And I'll take his dark glasses, too. <laughs> yeah, why not take his underwear? Joey, wake up, you metal moron! If you're at it. What happened? You missed all the action. Couldn't help it. My anti-stress circuit took over. Hmm. It seems security have mistaken me for a guy called Overman. Yeah. I really wanted to have that sandwich of Mr. Higgins, but I may have screwed this up, actually. Since we are now out of the plant and presumably can't go back. That might prove to be a fatal mistake. Or maybe not. We are way up in the clouds, Joey! We need to find a way to the ground. Yes. We need to, we need to find a way out of the city. And... Apparently, it's not just as easy as walking into an elevator. Because this elevator seems to be guarded. What's going on? Security alert. Interlevel movement is suspended. Tell him you've got a gun, Rob. <laughs> Did your vacuum cleaner speak? <laughs> no, I'm a ventriloquist. 
What do you take me for, a dummy? No. No, really. Watch this. A day, a day, a day. <laughs> I saw your lips move. <laughs> you didn't. Did too. I've seen better acts. At the security services social center. That must be a nice place to hang around. When will the movement ban be lifted? When Link is satisfied that mm. the threat has been removed. Maybe we are the threat? Hmm. You're doing a grand job, officer. Move along now! <laughs> yeah, at least he got the irony. I have to get to ground level. Sorry to disappoint you, sir. But nobody's going anywhere. Especially not second-rate entertainers. You're doing a grand job, officer. Move along now! Hmm. Okay, so... We have to find another way. Out of the city. <laughs> Why not use the elevator? Couldn't open that, even with a crowbar. Maybe you can open it with an ID card. Either it's the wrong card, or the elevator's not working. Mm. Which means I'm trapped. Yes, you are. Oh, that's a notice. I haven't noticed that. Bit of tsh. Oh. Yeah, I'm sorry for this joke, ladies and gentlemen. Interlevel access suspended during routine anti-terrorist strike. Security services protecting the community. Yeah, somehow we have to convince Link that the threat has been eliminated. Yeah, and just um, in order to show you how easy it is to get yourself killed. Um, I should give you a short demonstration. It's some kind of security device. Hmm. Probably not important. Couldn't open that, even with a crowbar. Let's just go into... Couldn't open that. Let's just use our fake ID card. I'm sure nothing Having a problem wrong. with your card? Uh, Let no, me sir. check that for you. No, I'm, I'm, I'm fine, sir. Really. Don't, don't worry. My card is coated with porridge. Porridge? Yeah, I dropped it in my breakfast. I meant to clean it, but I forgot. <laughs> I've done that so many times myself. Really? It's so easily done, isn't it? You're having breakfast, you're in a rush, and plop. You see, being a Your card submerged in soggy cereal. Hmm. I don't think so. I think he's being serious about this. But let's try to use. It's a this standard card. card slot. Let's try to use this card again. Just to see what happens. Not you again. Come here. Are you using that dirty card again? I tried wiping it on my sleeve. Give me that card now. If you insist. I think we've hmm. made a mistake. Looks just fine. Must have been a glitch in the scanner. Must have been. But maybe we won't be so lucky this time. Yeah. There's one bone every minute, eh? 
That'll teach him not to use stolen ID. It will teach us indeed, so... With that, and we shall continue next time. So, until then, folks. Until then.